Welcome everyone, my name is Julius and I'm the Senior Executive for Public Sector at the South African Institute of Chartered Accountants. In this recording, we are going to talk to the questions of which types of engagements would qualify as an examination in terms of the South African Schools Act. In terms of the South African Schools Act, there is a requirement on the assurance provisions in Section 43 that an audit must be performed on the financial statements of a public school and in instances where an audit is impracticable that a person who is qualified to be an accounting officer of a closed corporation should be appointed to examine and report on the financial statements of a public school. The big question here is what does this examination mean? Looking through the South African Schools Act, there is no explanation of what type of engagement would constitute an examination. Therefore, the practitioner is left to their own devices to decide which engagement they can take. I fake uh, pronouncements for practitioners who are members of professional accountancy organizations that are members of that institute, prescribe a few engagements that could be looked at as options. And three of them are, one, review engagements, the second one is an agreed upon procedures engagement, and the last one is a compilation engagement. Now let's look at these three options. The first one is a review engagement. A review engagement is more or less similar to an audit. However, the difference is that the review engagement is done to be able to express a negative opinion. So it does not give positive assurance. So the conclusion on a review engagement would state that the practitioner has no reason to believe that the financial statements are misstated or otherwise. An agreed upon procedures engagement is where the practitioner, the organization and maybe another third party agree on procedures of an audit nature and the practitioner would report on factual findings. The last one is a compilation engagement. A compilation engagement is where the practitioner takes the information of the entity and helps them to prepare the set of financial statements. Now, if we had to look at the substance of what an examination would be, it would mean that there is some level of external verification of transactions in the public school. The first engagement, which is a review engagement, appears to be clearly meeting the requirement of an examination. An agreed upon procedures engagement also meets the requirements of an examination. But a compilation engagement would be more suited to help the school comply with the requirements in Section 42 to prepare financial statements rather than the assurance requirements of Section 43. However, there is also a challenge with an agreed upon procedures in that Many of the departments of education in South Africa expect an opinion or a conclusion to be reached out of whatever engagement a practitioner does on the financial statements of a public school. And that is not going to be arrived at with an agreed upon procedures engagement. So if you find yourself in that situation, you actually only have one option left, which is a review engagement. So in summary, an examination is not defined in the public school uh, legislation, but if you find yourself in that situation, you can either evaluate to look at agreed upon procedures, review engagements, or compilation. Compilation will not meet the requirements. Agreed upon procedures will meet the requirement, but will not give you the practical requirement of the department. And you are, in many instances, only left with the review engagement. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.